Hey Pisces and Pisces lovers and friends. Welcome back to the Pisces portal. This is going to be a general reading for Pisces Collective. So it might resonate, it might not. Pisces, let's take a look at your person's energy at this time and how they are feeling, what they are thinking. Let's see what we got here. Okay, so we have compassion here. I think that this person really views you as someone who is very loving, very caring and kind, okay? Um, they see you as being very open to them. Let's see what else. But then we have denial here. I acknowledge my fear, but I replace it with the insight of awareness. <clears throat> so Pisces, I feel like this person is really denying you their love right now. Okay, they're denying being open with you the way you're open with them. Okay, so you might feel like they're unaware of who you truly are beyond all of the superficial stuff, but they they know. They just pretend to be unaware. And it's because of their own fears. I feel like being closer to you and more authentic with you is something that they want, but they've been in fear of a love like this for so long that they almost don't really know what to do or how to approach you. Yeah, we have love here. So again, this person does love you. They see you as being very loving. But, you know, they're really kind of hurting themselves because your feelings for them are real and they're aware of that, but they're denying themselves, Pisces. They're not allowing themselves to um, really bask in the feelings that you have for them. I want to get more on why. Why is this person not allowing themselves to just be loved? Um, perhaps they feel unworthy. Let's see. Well, this fell out. I didn't even get a chance to shuffle, but breakup fell out. I think that this person is still a bit affected or traumatized from a breakup. Okay. I think that a breakup took a lot out of them and almost to the point where being met with someone like you who has all of this love here to give to them, it really almost in a way turns them off. And it's only because 
they felt like they had the same thing with someone before. And since it didn't work how they wanted it to, it's like any sign of love coming back into their life makes them afraid because of a breakup. in a child. I feel like this breakup really really took some of their light away, Pisces. Okay. Um they also could have had a child with this person that they were with. Yeah, it's almost like they were, they were very much so caught off guard by this last relationship not working out the way that they hoped. Okay, um, they also could have had a child unexpectedly too. So there's a lot that they might deal with with that person and their child. Spying in reverse here. I also think that they keep an eye out on their ex as well. And we have mirroring here. Yeah, I think this person, they project a lot. They project this situation onto what the both of you have here. And the energy is completely different. Okay, but... I think that's really a testament of how deeply they felt hurt is this breakup caused them so much pain to the point where it doesn't matter if they can consciously perceive and be aware of someone real being in front of them. They're just to be on the safe side, they're just going to, you know, project the same assumptions onto you, okay, or anyone for all of that matter. So, yeah, they they are denying themselves true love with you because of a past relationship. longing but see you know they could in a way be longing for this past person but more than that I feel like they long for what it is that they wanted with them okay so they wanted real love and you know stability commitment and fun times with this past person um but they also long for that generally speaking okay so this person is still very much so hurt pisces and it has nothing to do with you we have boundaries and we have intuition. So, yeah, this person, they have some, uh, I mean, yes, they're boundaries, but at the same time, these boundaries that they have in place prevent them from being able to um, really enjoy their connection with you. And I think this is, Something that you're already aware of too, Pisces. I feel like you know that this person has been through a lot and that they're projecting. And I also feel like you're trying to keep boundaries up as well because you know you don't want them to hurt you because they've been hurt, okay? We have unavailable. This person is unable to give all you deserve. Yeah, it's like you are here again with so much love to give and yet this person 
again, they're projecting onto you something that is not even true. This person's boundaries make them unavailable to, again, accept your love, Pisces. Let's see. We have deception. Someone is wearing a false self mask in this relationship. It's, yeah, it's this person, Pisces. They, they're not ready to fully be themselves, okay? They have a lot that they hide behind, but you're intuitive. So it's like, they can't necessarily hide from you. Religious factors. Your love life is influenced by your religious upbringing and spiritual path. So I, you know, this could be another reason why, um, why this person, it's like they want love, but at the same time, they really haven't, again, been open to receiving it. And I think one of the reasons why is because they could be a little mad at God. Okay, I think they went into this last relationships or even marriage with open arms for this person, ready to give them all of their love just for it to end and for them to feel heartbroken. Um, I feel like in some strange way, this person doesn't trust that anymore. Like they don't trust... Um, perhaps like the institution of marriage or even religion because they feel like they fell for that all just for them to get played or hurt. Yeah, we have getting to know each other. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. Pisces, I do think that at some point, you and this person will get to know each other on a deeper level because with the denial card, they say that they want to replace their fear with the insight of awareness. And what that means to me is that they want to go beyond these very stone cold boundaries that they have in place that would just push you or um, anyone else away for all that matter. So this person is not very trusting. They have some valid reasons as to why they are not so open to love. But I think there will be a moment where you both are able to kind of pierce that veil a little bit, where they're able to truly see you instead of, you know, seeing their ex or seeing their pain when it comes to moving forward. Get to know each other. Psst, wow. Learn to meet another's need for love. See, this is all it's going to really take. You and this person being respectful and understanding of one another and very patient and getting to know each other. Um, maybe even at a bit of a snail pace. This is going to be really important in terms of this person being able to get over um, or get through what they've experienced. Simple acts of kindness. Kindness energizes you and brings happiness to those around you. I don't think this person has like experienced um, someone's kindness 
in a romantic relationship like this in a while. Or if someone has, again, you know, they blocked it out. They made themselves unavailable to receive that person's kindness and care. I think they, you know, they feel like you're too good to be true. Turn on your heart light. Reflect on a time when you experience love. That is what this person is trying to do, Pisces. And what they're trying to work through. This is how they replace their fear with the insight of awareness. Being aware that love is real. And that this person that they broke up with or who broke up with them is not the end all be all. They are not the final say on what's possible for love in their life. So I'm going to close this out with an angel answers card, Pisces. Ooh. We have forgiveness. That is what this person needs to do. They need to forgive, okay? Forgive themselves, forgive, you know, this past person, let it go so that they can move forward. And then we have yes. So yeah, forgiveness is what is going to really um, open the door for them within themselves so that they can be more open to your love, compassion, your kindness, and everything else. So Pisces, this has been your reading. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you later. Bye.